Hey everyone, I'm the Miniac, and I have a great video for you today. It's an intake install on my friend's 2005 Mini Cooper S. The intake was purchased from minimania.com, and a link for it will be in the description below. Now, rather than me talk throughout the video and tell you everything I'm doing, you're going to be watching me actually put it in and talking to the owner of the car and seeing the struggles and frustrations that come along with putting one of these in like when I dropped a screw and I had to go hunt it down or when I put the heat shield in and I had to take it back out to attach the filter and the coupler to the intake hose because that wasn't in the instructions so we had to use the photograph in there after we had already had it put into the car now it doesn't always go in as easy as you think it would despite what you see on some of these videos on YouTube but I'm going to have you all watch it. It's about 13 minutes long or so, and you be the judge. It took us about an hour to put the intake in, about an hour, hour and a half or so. But anyway, on with the video. Make sure they follow the directions. Laying out everything. Weather stripping. Clamps. Filter. And tools. Negative battery cable has to be disconnected. Is your trunk clear? So you have to remove this. Is this an 05? Yep. That's what I thought. You can tell by kind of the tow hooks. Or the tie-down hooks. What are those for? The tie-down hooks here. Yeah. Um, on the 2006 models, the later run, they actually had three or two in the back or four four in the back two on each side but what's the purpose tie down your luggage so there's the battery and that's the negative terminal and we need to disconnect that and then pull pull it away and make sure it doesn't come back in contact with the battery Seriously? Yeah, apparently that's the way to do it. Now I have to figure out how to pop it loose. Alright. Actually, I could just do that. down. There, that's not going to work. Alright. Disconnect from the air box. Locate the battery terminal on the left side of the air box. Remove by pulling plug. By pulling upward. Loosen the two bolts on the front of the air box. So, put the camera right in here. 
So these two Torx head bolts have to come out. Just keep going? Yeah. And I believe, I'm not sure what T model they are. Like a T34, T35, but I think they're a T35. Yep. Also, you may want to keep that there just for the same side. Slide the air box cover backwards, then pull upward. Here we go. That's the cover. Use factory air filter element. Those torques, yes, they are. and the lower one. Okay. Place the Minimina airbox heat shield and position with the coupler towards the front of the car. to get it in here. There we go. There we go. All right. Insert the upper bolt. While at the same time reattaching the lower one. No, why not? I know what they, I know what they mean. They mean loosely. Insert the upper bulk. Do not tighten. Yep. Using the two number 10 screws with washers, attach the front edge of the new heat shield. So down here, we have to attach those with new screws they provide in the kit. So these screws right here, which means I need to use different, so very handy having this thing right here. Where's the drill? There it is. Switch out the head for a Phillips. Just take one screw, one washer, put them together. Drop them like I just did. Luckily, yeah. I had to go for it. Fiddle our hands. Well, actually, hold on. Let me grab the pliers. Gosh. To complete fit and then keep going. See, my concern is trying to get that down there. Oh my gosh, do we have any? Uh, I wouldn't get for some blue right 
So not all, power tools aren't always the answer. And sometimes things don't work out the way you plan, so you have to start back over. Attach the battery terminal to the new clip. There we go. Reattach negative battery cable. Head around to the back. We put everything back. And that's a completed intake. Okay, go. Give it a little gas. enjoyed that video if you have any questions feel free to comment down below remember to like comment and subscribe and as always i am the miniac and remember it's not about the destination it's about the journey thanks for watching